The Law of Self-Defense, Top 10 Things You Probably Don't Know About Self-Defense Law. I got that DVD from Andrew Bronca's website. And I must say, it was money well spent. Because there were things that I did not know about self-defense that I think are worth the listen. Now, so basically, if you want to cut out this video now, Top 10 things you probably don't know about self-defense law. Go ahead and get it. And I don't really want to give away the content that's on the DVD. Even just showing this up, I guess if somebody were to zoom in, grab a screenshot or whatever, they could probably see some of the points, but I'm not going to read all of them off. I'll, I'll read one that I thought was pretty interesting. Um, plain English... Reading of statutes can be dangerous. So, you want to know what that means? Get the DVD. But what I do want to say is, um, I didn't use the DVD player, I used my computer. Now, uh, this is not a criticism of it, this is just a word to the wise. I have a Windows 10 laptop, so in order for me to read it, I tried using Windows Media Player. Didn't work. I used the Power Media Player that came with the app. Now, if you have, a, I have another box here that's an older version of Windows. I have a feeling that the media player probably would have worked with that because for some reason on that old machine, it's, an, it's a uh, Vista box that just gets updated. For some reason, that old box will run like anything. And I don't know why. The media player probably would have worked on that and just would have been slow and annoying. But on a modern box, just use a power media player. Cyberlink Power Media Player app work just fine. I guess it'll work on the DVD too. So get the DVD, give it a uh, give it a look, listen, and check it out. That's all I got to say. Oh, one more thing. He's talking about gun law on here. Since nobody else is really specializing in martial arts self defense law that I know of, I'm looking at the gun law specialist here, and that's Andrew Bronca. I'm looking at what he says about gun law and extrapolating it and applying it to martial arts law. So not all the time, but a lot of times if you see, oh, he says like a martial artist asked a question. A lot of times lately, that's been me. There have been other martial artists that have asked questions, too, on some of his live broadcasts. So because to me, self-defense law, is self-defense law, um, I'm not. You know, I know our bodies are supposed to be weapons, but I don't think that really holds up legally. But just in terms of use of force, perhaps there is some wisdom that can be gained. So that's why I look over there. So please check out the uh, top 10. Let me put this in closer. The top 10 things you probably don't know about self-defense law. Take a look. It's worth your time. I liked it. And I'm going to be looking at it again and again. Peace.